Hi, Tim Roberts, Application Engineer with Go Engineer. I wanted to make a video on a question I got earlier this week regarding um, multiple users sharing SOLIDWORKS on the same machine. And um, so let's take uh, the fact that, uh, you know, we've got one guy perhaps doing the analysis. You know, he's the, uh, the FEA guy and he's doing a lot of analysis. Um, so his toolbars, if you look up here on the command manager, he's always got, you know, simulation on. And, um, and maybe some other things not relevant to another user. Now, I will say that if you've got separate uh, Windows profile logins, um, th this is not an issue, right? This is a situation where we've got two users using the same computer, but they share a login. You know, they log in as generic user. Okay, so in, in that situation, what we could do, and this is the solution I put forth, uh, we have under uh, SolidWorks 2015, SolidWorks Tools, uh, something called the Copy Settings Wizard. Um, okay, so we can uh, have, let's say, Tom. Um, we'll say he's the FEA user. So he sets up his toolbars, his shortcuts, uh, everything like he likes, and then he saves out his settings using this utility. And uh, by the way, it says have open session. Do I want to include those? Yes, I do. He can include everything here, system options, toolbars, mouse gestures, menu customization. So he's going to save out his file to, um, to an SLD reg file. So we'll finish that. OK. And now he's got his settings. And if he wants to go and use those on another computer, he can take that SLD reg file and read it in. OK. So then we've got another user who's doing uh, assembly stuff and, and no FEA. So he doesn't really want uh, any of the, uh, the toolbars that Tom has. Let's call this guy Dave. Okay, so for this guy, uh, same thing. He's going to open up the uh, copy settings wizard and he's going to do a restore settings. Okay. Now this is going to be very tricky. They're each going to have a safe place for their SLD reg file. But when he comes in, maybe he's got his on a flash drive or, or, or just knows where it's at. He'll, he'll do a restore settings. Uh, select next and he'll browse out to his file and he will read that in to give him his settings. Okay. So by the way, when we do that, uh, we get an option here and you're, in that situation you just say current user. These options for, uh, for network computers or roaming profiles, these are usually administrator options. Um, so that's how two users can share uh, uh, one computer, one login, but still have their own settings in SOLIDWORKS. So a little tricky, can be done. Um, I would probably suggest separate uh, Windows profile logins myself. But thanks for watching this quick tip video. My name is Tim Roberts.